Do you know that data is everywhere and it is a powerful tool for helping us make better informed decisions? But how do we actually use this particular data to help us understand what actually happened, why it happened, what might happen next, and what should we do about it? This is where the four types of data analysis actually comes in. In this video, I'm going to walk you through on what is descriptive analysis, diagnostic analysis, predictive analysis, and finally, we're going to be looking at prescriptive analysis. Each of these particular analysis types serves a different purpose and together they help us understand better decisions based on data. Descriptive analysis answers the question, what happened? It looked at your past data to tell you what happened in a clear and straightforward way. It helps you understand trends and patterns. For example, if you own a store, descriptive analysis can actually tell you how much you sold last month, which particular products were your best sellers, and how many customers visited your store. Diagnostic analysis answers the question, why did it happen? It helps you understand why something happened by looking deeper into the data that you have. Take for instance, if a store sales dropped in a certain month, diagnostic analysis might actually show you that a new competitor opened nearby. Your popular products were out of stock. There was less marketing or fewer promotions that particular month. Predictive analysis uses past data to predict what might happen in the future. It helps you prepare for the possible future trends or events. Take for instance, based on your sales data over the last few months, predictive analysis can actually estimate how much you are likely to sell next month, predict which particular product will be in demand and where your sales are likely to come from. Prescriptive analysis goes a step further by suggesting what actions to take to get the best results from your data. If a prediction was made that your sales might drop next month, prescriptive analysis could actually recommend you to increase your marketing efforts to attract more customers and offering discounts to boost sales. On a quick recap, Descriptive analysis tells you what happened in the past. Diagnostic analysis explains why it actually happened. Predictive analysis predicts what might actually happen in the future. And finally, prescriptive analysis recommends what to do next. These particular types of analysis help businesses understand their data and make smarter decisions. So here are some lists of the tools you could actually learn for either of those analyses. For descriptive analysis, you can actually learn tools like Excel, Power BI, Tableau, Google Data Studio. And for diagnostic analysis, you can learn tools like SQL, Microsoft Excel, Power BI, and as well, you can learn Tableau for data visualization. And for predictive analysis, you can learn tools like Python, R, Power BI, Azure Machine Learning. And finally, for prescriptive analysis, you can learn Python, R, IBM for data analysis, and as well, you can learn Azure Machine Learning. All right, everyone. Now that you have actually understand the four types of data analysis, choosing the right tools depends on your level of expertise and the things you need. Tools like Microsoft Excel, Power BI, and Tableau are great for beginners and widely used for descriptive and diagnostic analysis. As you move into more advanced and complex data analysis like predictive and prescriptive analysis, you can actually consider learning tools like Python, R, or any other complex tools that could do the complex job for you. Thanks for watching.
see you in my other videos.